Hey guys, it's time to do this, the Castlevania feature. And here's the very first Castlevania game, Castlevania, on the NES. Let's play it. Ah, uh, yeah, I love this fucking game. Da, 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 da. So here we are, outside the castle, for level one, with the braziers. And my whip's a little more powerful. And I got a long fucking whip, playing as... The original Castlevania hero, Simon Belmont. I've got a dagger. Oh. Ah, didn't work. Okay. So you get a power up if you can jump past the door. Here come some zombies. Yeah. Love this fucking game. I'm glad everybody enjoyed the bond feature, although I got some fucked up comments. It's like, man, you know, obviously reviews are my opinions. I don't really care what anybody else's are. I mean, if you want to, you know, offer your opinions, that's great, but you're like, you get these people like, you are completely wrong in all your reviews. Like, shut the fuck up. Eat my ass. Ooh, holy water. What you really want on this first level is an axe, though. I gotta get up there, actually. Climb, Simon, climb. I've decided that I will be doing videos for every single Castlevania game. There are some that I really have no way of recording. Well, I, I think I can possibly get a PlayStation emulator going for Symphony of the Night and Chronicles. Um, well, my copy of Symphony of the Night is pretty fucked up. So I'm probably going to have to, you know, like get an ISO or something. Because my copy, it just fucks up so much. I just got to, like, choose what PlayStation emulator to use and whatnot. I think there's a secret down here. If you kind of go like this and you duck. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to bother getting it because it's just points. But I figured I'd show you. There's a lot of like little secrets like that in, ooh, in Castlevania. Dun, 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 dun. Up here. All right. Unless this thing says stage two and then I pass it or it'll say stage three. It's kind of weird. Technically, I'm still in stage one. I don't know what you're talking about. Is that invincibility potion that lasts for like three seconds? It's ridiculous. It's already wearing off. I never got an axe. Isn't there one over here? Huh. That's okay. I don't really need an axe. I can beat him with the whip. This is the phantom bat. Oh, hello. I used to beat this guy with the whip just for the hell of it. Just, just for the challenge, you know? Not many people know this, but after, he can throw fireballs at you. It's just most people kill him so fast that he never even bothers with the fireballs. Oh, I'm sucking today. <laughs> Come on. Oh, one more hit. Come on. Well, actually, two more, I think. Come on, you jackass. And he's going to lunge at me, too. Come on, fucker. Oh, if he hits me again, I'm dead. There we go. Jesus Christ, that was succular. Yeah. <laughs> Usually there's an axe there. I guess I must have missed it. Moving on to stage two. So six stages in this. Got a boomerang. A cross, whatever you want to call it. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I love doing that. Do, do. Nee, 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 nee. I think I have something on the wall there, but seriously, who cares? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I think there's something like right there. Yeah, double shot. I want that. Let you throw two of them at once. Oh, 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 don't, 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 oh, yeah, like, this is just points. I just figured I'd show you that. -na 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 -na. This is a part that 
has annoyed many a game gamer. You just gotta be patient. Oh 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 oh! oh. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> oh, that was fucking assy. Oh oh. <laughs> oh, it disappeared. <laughs> It's so hard to play. People don't realize it's so hard to play these games and talk at the same time. I get this comment on like this old game that I did, Forgotten Worlds. I completely forgot about that game, and they're like, "This is a good game. You're just bad at it." It's like you should practice, and it's like, how would that help me do a commentary video? The point is to play these games and just record my commentary. And if I never played them before, that's a great opportunity to get really candid first impressions of a game. I mean, obviously, a lot of these games I've played before. But, you know, when I get to a game that I've never played before, like Forgotten Worlds, I think it's a really great opportunity to... Uh-oh, oh, 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 oh To get, you know, an, uh, just like a, a first impression. Because you only get a, one first impression for a game. Doesn't happen again, you know? Unless you somehow wipe it from your memory. Like, do like eternal sunshine of the spotless mind. These things kill you instantly, so you have to be really careful. When I was a kid, this part drove me crazy. Now it's no big deal. The ghost. I think there's a... yeah. Up, 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 up. Mm, 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 mm. For some reason, when I was a kid, those things drove me crazy, too. Ooh. Six shots. This is pretty much the end of this stage. I love the rosary. I usually have holy water at this point. What is with the items? All right, here's Queen Medusa. this. She's not getting off my fucking grill. Ah, oh, damn. That was assy. Let's try that again. It's been so long since I played this. Even so, I should be doing better. Yeah, come on. There's the holy water. I somehow skipped that last... Oh! <laughs> oh, that was fucking cool. Uh... I <laughs> As embarrassing as it is, I was kind of wanting to show how those things are killer like that. So, <laughs> there you have it. <laughs> Come on, I know that's the thing. Oh, it's not. Oh, maybe this one. No. Hmm. hmm. Weird. There you go. You see, the reach and the whip is actually longer than it seems. It's kind of a weird thing. <laughs> it's like, I usually have holy water for that battle. It's kind of unprepared with triple shot. Nice. I may mean, not pick up anything else then. I don't need anything else. I'm just going to own her so fast. She's going to be like an owned pie. Oh. Ah, shit. C come on. Why won't you. You do what I want you to do. There we go. There we go. Owned. Got extra life, too. I'm at nine minutes. I'm only going to be able to show probably part of level three, but hey. There you go. Is the map. This is the crazy flea man. Flea man! I love the music in this song, stage. This is in level 5 have really good themes. I love that shit. It's a little upbeat for a Castlevania song, but enjoyable overall. Can you believe they don't have skeletons until level 3 in this? It's unthinkable. 
I know you thought I wonder why there's like like a staircase in the air there. That's gotta be like a graphical error. Yeah, I ate my shit. <laughs> this is like random staircase in here. I, I don't know. I, I like it could be like because it's ruins or something, but I really don't think it's that. I think it's like an error in the game. I'm almost singing along with this. This is actually words that somebody wrote to this. Uh, this this band called Game Over. They take like classic Nintendo tunes, and they not only do heavy metal versions of them, but they uh, oh shit, I don't want the stopwatch. They actually make lyrics, which I think is so cool. And they've done you know one or two Castlevania songs, and this is one of them. Well, you know what? That's going to be it for now. So we'll see you with the next one soon.